Hello and welcome to another tutorial Chooks Day, still at the seaside, so we thought we'd do a little sea shanty roll intro. So we are still at the seaside and then you saw my pirate ship and that's a bit of a Captain Jack Sparrow sort of a thing and Pirates of the Caribbean obviously is coming out soon. Our good friend Kevin McNally um, who often comes to our gigs but he's a lovely chap and a great actor who is of course uh, the uh, first mate in Pirates of the Caribbean. Bandit ship. And all that sort of thing. So we're going to do, in the mood, we're going to do a little, uh, what should we do with the drunken sailor which is a uh, very old folk song and sea shanty. And uh, once she's got like two, that's all right, you can come by. Look, loads of people here because it's lovely and warm in England. How often does that happen? And uh, so basically, yeah, it's a sea shanty. Um, and once you, it's like two chords. It's like the easiest thing you're ever going to learn. And also once you do it, there's loads of sea shanties and, and, and like folk songs that you can do with the two chords. And it's got a lovely sound. You can repeat it for ages, make up words to it and uh, do that sort of thing. So what should we do with the drunken sailor? Or uh, I don't know, what solution do we have for the inebriated marine worker? Uh, here we go, to be politically correct. So uh, I'll, give, I'll sing it first, here we go. If you want. What should we do with the drunken sailor? What should we do with the drunken sailor? What should we do with the drunken sailor? Early in the morning. Rain up she rises, rain up she rises, rain up she rises, oh lion them morning. So very good. Two chords backwards and forwards. And uh, so one of the chords is you already know because I seem to be doing it every week at the moment, which is C. Right, open and just on the first fret, uh, first string. On the first string, I've got all pirate. On the first string, on the third fret, as you see, because it's a C shanty. What a terrible pun! Where do you get those jokes? The next one is you may not have already had before, is basically D minor, which is lovely and gives it that minory sound. So that finger there, that finger there, you see, which is basically a bit like an F. If I already know the F and like that there and then this finger comes down on the string in between those two uh, on the second fret on the third string so it's on the uh, first fret second string third fret uh, third string on a second fret fourth string on a second fret it's easy it's all right hello loads of people in towers walking by this shows you because we're actually in england and it's sunny this is very unusual doesn't happen that often. But it will from now on if you keep playing Bring Me Sunshine. There you go, there's your D minor. It's a lovely sound there. Hello. This is a ukulele. No? Giving a lesson already. Do you want to go? Brilliant. Put your finger on there. There. Just there. There you go. There you go. It's the first chord. That's easy. Anyway, that's basically the chords. You've heard how it goes. So if you click down there, you can get the little uh, the chord book, uh, chord sheet, and you'll see how to do it. Click all the other things that Alex is going to put up and uh, share this. Learn your sea shanty, and we can all be pirates. There you go. That's how easy it is. <laughs> 